staff at the SAN are quite extraordinary. I would come in every day and, you know, I'm a busy wife and mum, so I have to put on my game face every day. I take the children to school, I rush around and do all my different jobs and then I come home. But when I get to the SAN, I can be me, I can be the cancer patient, I can relax and take that mask off. And the nurses let me be me. Joy, faith, compassion, sensitivity, and fun. That's what I see in the staff here. And apart from the fact they all do a good job, but you know, there's there's a there's a sense of happiness in this organization. We believe that human beings are not just body. Our mission statement is caring for the body, mind and spirit. Everyone needs to know that they are not alone when they are in the hospital. There is someone that comes alongside them to provide comfort, to provide hope and to make sure that they know that there is someone there to walk with them as they journey through the procedures that they need to go through. And it's not just about the building and it's not just about the multidisciplinary meeting room. It's about the people here at the SAN. It's about the people in the day infusion. It's about the people on our wards who really have made a big difference in improving our patients' outcomes. Is I look at someone and think they're a mother, a father, a brother, an auntie, an uncle, someone's relative is the person that I'm charged with looking after. So if I think I can bring that empathy and that care and that sort of sense of value and community to how I look after that person, I think I want to treat them the way my family would expect to be treated. I have not met one person that I didn't get along with. They were just so wonderful, so friendly, so willing to teach and help and being a new person is really daunting. It's so scary but uh, these people just made you feel right at home. I hear the most beautiful stories, I see the most wonderful, wonderful loving relationships and I see this regularly, you know. So do I love my job? Yeah, you bet yeah, I do. Behind me here is my active, and I like to call it my wall of fame. We have 500 active volunteers of all ages, of all different cultures here um, in Sydney, um, and they all find a place here at the sand where they love to give back. Even the colour yellow is a brightening of the areas because the nurses have to do their clinical bits and pieces. Um, so the volunteers, I suppose, provide that step between the clinical to personal, a home, so to speak. I think that, I mean, the care that I experienced was, was so consistent and so kind and so enveloping I think without spiritual care, I would have felt that there was a, an element of my care that was missing. And I th don't think until you've experienced it that you even know it would be missing. We don't work in isolation as a team. We are a, a, a adjunct service to the medical services people come here to receive. I, I can't say it's not a great sadness, nothing sadder, but it's that sadness has been helped so much by the people that were here and how they cared for my mother. Because if that hadn't been the case, I, I probably wouldn't be able to ever feel whole again, you know? And they really just made mum stay special and, and mine as well. I don't know how it works. I don't know how it works. How we have this, this shift which goes from the start to the end and everybody at the end, every patient at the end is well cared for. Um, uh, technically and uh, emotionally, that all the jobs are done, all the medication charts are filled out properly, right? all those things are done. Uh, we go home, the patient go home to the ward, how we start at, at the start and end at that, and the whole day is a complete mess of tasks. This bizarre mess of, I'll do that, you do that, can we do that, can we go over there, uh, okay, um, can I call, all those things happen and somehow at the end of the day, it all works. It's amazing and there's a certain personality group that makes that happen and they're over there. They're over there. Are you proud of them? They're fantastic. They're fantastic. Anyway, that's us.